everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Yeji, like yay G, and today I have another Gymshark haul for you. And this one is the biker shorts from their newest launch um, of the Flex series. So I don't know about you, but from my perspective, I just can't keep up with Gymshark. They just have so many launches every single time, and I just browse their website once in a while just to see, you know, what's new and. I'm just weird like that. I just like looking at leggings and bras and little cute sets like that. Anyway, so I, I go on to the website once in a while, but I notice that like every single time I go on to it, there's a new launch, there's a new series, and I don't know about you, but I just feel like they're pushing products at you and they don't even announce it. So it's like they're mass producing and it just kind of lost the the sense of Gymshark or the image of Gymshark that I used to have back in the days where they have like the core collections um, like the Flex series and the Vital series that kind of took off and became popular like really popular so anyway I have the biker shorts and a, the, the bra on top um, I'm wearing an extra small and I wanted to review this how it fits, how it looks on me and my body type and also compare it to the regular length of leggings instead of the biker shorts but those I have in a previous collection in different colors but I just wanted to compare the fit and all. So if you like this kind of content, please subscribe and like and ring my bell and keep on watching. So I picked up these on an extra small in the blue marl. Now, I feel like you need to have a certain body type with biker shorts like you have to be really skinny um, and like long for biker shorts to really look attractive on you because I'm sure 5'3 and I wouldn't say like chunky but you know I'm like sure so <laughs> these biker shorts they come on really long and also like my um, calves like up to my knees and all um, it's not long enough to kind of elongate my frame if that makes sense so I feel like if you're like 5'5 five, five or taller, maybe they'll look better on you. But right off the bat, this is the problem I have with the Flex series. The band is super tight, it's excellent, like it holds you in and feels compressive. But the material right below the band is a different like fabric. I mean it's the same fabric but just compression is different because there's ribbing where the band is. I don't know if you can see. And then right below it is just the regular fabric that they have. And so if you look from the side, it looks like I have a little pouch. Do you see that? Like, but I don't. So from this front, it's fine, right? But then again on the side, it just looks like I have a little pouch. And I don't like that look of a little pouch. And the thing about the Flex series is that they highlight your contours. But it also kind of makes my butt look squished. From the side, it's not so bad, but then I feel like if you look at a direct frontal, like it just squishes it because it's a lighter color and it's darker here. Um, it just looks like, I know it's meant to pop, but it doesn't pop, it just looks a bit squished. And not, I'm not a, and also I'm not really a big fan of that. I think. Instead of the biker shorts, I think I prefer the regular, like, longer leggings. Um, I, I just don't think that I have the frame for biker shorts. Unless they come up, like, the shorts come up a little higher, um, then I feel like my legs will look a bit elongated. But because the biker shorts are longer, hence the name biker shorts, I just feel like only a select group of people can wear them. But one thing that has changed from these shorts is that the logo um, is kind of like hot stamped in a way, but in a way that's not going to come off. But I can feel the logo, whereas the previous collections, like I couldn't necessarily feel the logo. So it's a bit raised, the logo. But overall, like it's literally the same design as the regular length leggings. Um, they just cut it short, basically. Um, another thing the logo has changed is that instead of having the square at the back they just kind of put the Gymshark logo on it and got rid of the background square which I think is um, a cleaner look. Now moving on to the bra. Um, the thing about the bra. Now I know it's meant to be like a sports bra and meant to compress you but the way it's like made 
is that it goes up and then it you know how it goes up because of the straps instead of just staying here with the straps so it kind of makes my square like shoulders look a bit like or chest area look a bit smaller than they should be because of the way that these are kind of pointing for the straps so that look I'm not a big fan but other than that they are comfortable um, they do have padding so if you get cold or whatnot like your boobage area won't show <laughs> Also the back, like I mentioned before, um, they removed the logo. Compared to other bras that Gymshark has, I think the Flex series has the best compression overall. Like if you're jumping or doing a lot of cardio, um, a lot of squats or whatnot, then I feel like this is the sports bra um, that might work better for you if you have like a larger chest. Also, um, this set is like a Marl material. So what I like about Marl is that when you sweat, it doesn't show the sweat as, the sweat is not as noticeable as just a solid color because it's Marled. Um, and I, I actually like that about um, this set and how like their design and the thought process behind it. Um, like as mentioned before, the compression is really good. Um, I just wish that like the bottom part was also compressive. I feel like if they wanted to make it compressive, they should just make the whole thing compressive all the way instead of just making the band compressive. That way you get that little pouch area. So these shorts are squat proof, like thank God, right? <laughs> um, and also the band, it doesn't like flare out at the back or the front compared to the other like Vital Seamless or the new Adapt Vital Seamless line that they have um, or the Vital Rise I should say so sometimes like from the side when you do squats or when you bend over even though you get the right size for you or you get a smaller size than you the band always like sticks out at the back a little bit for me this doesn't do that so I really 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 like that about this um, this line, the Flex series, um, that it just really sucks you in, <laughs> compressive, um, of course, except the little pouch down here. Um, but so if you have the body shape for it, I think um, this is the perfect like set and one of the best sets that Gymshark offers. Um, and also like in the summer, biker shorts, perfect because it's super hot. I know some gyms like on the treadmill, they don't have a fan to fan you. And so when you're running, then you just, you're just sweating. Um, and so it's nice that it's marl, so it doesn't sweat as much, or the sweat doesn't show as much if you sweat. Um, and also they're biker shorts, so you feel a little bit cooler. So this is the Flex series that I believe came out like two years ago. Um, it's the original ones, um, except it's like longer line instead of biker shorts. I still wear them, I still love them. I mean, it's lasted me two years, so they're really good quality. They wash well, but you can definitely tell like there's no logo here anymore that they have in the newer biker shorts. And the the branding here, it's you can still feel it. It's raised, but it's not raised as much as the newer versions. The newer versions, you can feel it like the silicone part. And also the biggest branding difference is the back. The logo has like the stamp, um, like the square stamp and then the logo is on top of that. Whereas the newer ones, they just have the logo like written on it. These are the same. They have a very good compression as the biker shorts. I mean, it's the same fabric. Um, it's nice and it sucks you in. Um, the back doesn't gape like some of the other lines such as the vital, vital seamless lines that Gymshark has. Um, same thing with the biker shorts though. The problem I have with these um, sometimes, not all the time, is that from the side you, it looks like you have a pouch when you don't. So that's just an issue I have. I don't know, is this an only issue that I have or do you guys have the same issue? Let me know because um, this is just something that bothers me whenever I wear this and I just feel like there must be other people out there that has the same issue as I do. So the contour is all the same, um, where it should be um, down the side and then down here. Um, it's all the same. It literally is just the biker version, it's just a shorter pant version. Now same thing with the sports bra. It's the same exact sports bra, just in different colors. 
So just to give you a recap of everything that I talk about is that the biker shorts are squat proof and I like that it's a marl material so similar to these older ones that's marl so that when you sweat the sweat doesn't like show as much well obviously it depends on how much you sweat I like the fact very 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 like the fact that the band is really good and compressive it, like it sucks you in now as I mentioned before the only problem is some days like you know once a month we have that time as women some days when you feel bloated let's say and it sucks you in but then like this little bottom part can you know pop out because it sucks you in at the top if that makes sense so that is just something that I always think about before wearing these um, as mentioned maybe you have the same problem maybe you don't but the branding has changed a little I feel like it's a newer and cleaner look um, I like that they keep updating, you know, the, the logo to keep up with the times to make it look more modern, and I like that. Um, personally, for me, I prefer the longer legging versions than the biker shorts, um, just purely because I feel like I don't have the body type. Uh, I feel like you need to be really thin and really, like, tall, like, long, right? Because otherwise your legs will look kind of squished and chunky, like, um, whereas if you wear the leggings, then it gives you that elongated look of the legs. The bra, um, I'm part of the itty bitty chest club, so I can't say how much it holds you in and stuff, but I can say the compression of it. Um, it is very compressive, so I feel like this is a medium support. So um, compared to other um, bras they have in the Gymshark line, I feel like out of all the other ones, maybe this one would be a better version. Um, for you because it compresses you a little more if you are a bit bigger chested than I am That was the review of the new flex biker shorts that Gymshark released I hope you enjoyed it and if you have any questions or comments Please let me know down in the comment box and I'll try to answer those questions for you um, Anyway, I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you guys next time